<laughs> what does it remind you of, this kind of song? It, it takes you back to the 60s, maybe a little tie-dye. Maybe a you little know, Maybe Scooby-Doo Maybe a little acid trip or something. Uh, something going on. Well, so, well it, it may be going on in the state of New Jersey sometime soon because their lawmakers are mulling a bill that would decriminalize the use of psychedelic mushrooms. State lawmakers introduced a bill that would allow the manufacturing and sale of magic mushrooms, which would also allow anyone over the age of 21 to use them without penalty. Right now, Oregon and Colorado are the only two states that have decriminalized the mushrooms. All right, so we want to hear from you. Should psychedelic mushroom use be decriminalized? We have an Insta poll now live on our homepage. Head over to fox5ny.com to cast your vote. Looks like most people are saying no. You know what? I'm going to say I'm a little surprised by that. What? Because I, I think that most people or a lot of people say they want the government out of your lives. I know. And if you're doing this in your home and you're not offending anybody else, as long as you're not on the public streets. Well, the, that's what the problem is, is that you don't know who's getting behind the wheel after. But we do that with alcohol. Right. We, and no, now we, we regulate do, it. I'm saying, you know, that it's illegal to drive. Right. And now so we, we do can do the same pot, thing with this. And there's, yes. there's now some kind of pushback there. Yeah, so, so there are now, ways to do it. Not saying that I'm voting yes or no, but I'm yeah. just, I was surprised yeah. that it was that unbalanced. It's, well, I think some people just use magic mushrooms in a way that are not, like, under a doctor's prescription. Mm. You know, they kind of medicate themselves. Yeah. Self-medication, yes. I think that's what that would legalize it. <laughs>